In the ever-evolving landscape of modern warfare, Russia's military-industrial complex continues to demonstrate its prowess with the development and deployment of the Kurganets 25, a next-generation infantry fighting vehicle IFV, that has sparked intense discussions among defense analysts worldwide. Touted as a superior alternative to the United States' M2 Bradley, the Kurganets 25 represents a significant leap forward in armored vehicle technology, blending cutting-edge protection, firepower, and versatility. As Russia strengthens its military capabilities, the question arises, how many KURGANETS-25 vehicles are currently in Russia's arsenal, and why does this platform outshine its Western counterparts? The Kurganets 25, developed by Russia's Kurgan Mashzavod KMZ factory, is a modular, tracked armored platform designed to replace aging Soviet-era vehicles like the BMP series. Unlike the M2 Bradley, which has been in service since the 1980s and relies on incremental upgrades, the Kurganets 25 was built from the ground up with 21st century warfare in mind. Its key features include advanced protection, superior firepower, modularity and versatility, crew comfort, and situational awareness. The Kurganets 25 is equipped with an active protection system APS, that can intercept incoming missiles and projectiles, a capability that the Bradley lacks in most configurations. Its composite armor and modular design provide superior resistance to modern anti-tank weapons, ensuring crew survivability in high-intensity conflicts. The vehicle mounts a 30mm 2A 42 autocannon, paired with a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun and advanced anti-tank guided missiles ATGMs. This combination allows the KURGANETS-25 to engage a wide range of targets, from infantry and armored vehicles to low-flying aircraft, with greater precision and lethality than the Bradley's 25mm M242 Bushmaster. Unlike the Bradley, which is primarily an IFV with limited variants, the Kurganets 25 platform supports multiple configurations including IFV, Armored Personnel Carrier APC, and Command Vehicle roles. This adaptability ensures Russia can tailor its forces to diverse operational needs without requiring entirely new platforms. The Kurganets 25 features an advanced digital architecture, including thermal imaging, network communication systems, and improved ergonomics. These enhancements give Russian crews a decisive edge in situational awareness and operational efficiency compared to the Bradley's older systems. Russia's investment in the Kurganets 25 reflects its commitment to maintaining a technological edge over NATO forces. While the Bradley has seen combat in multiple theaters, its reliance on outdated design principles and incremental upgrades pales in comparison to the Kurganets 25's forward-thinking engineering. How many Kurganets 25 vehicles does Russia have? Estimating the exact number of Kurganets 25 vehicles in Russia's inventory is challenging due to the secretive nature of military production and deployment. However, open source intelligence and reports from Russian defense circles provide some insight. As of mid-2024, the Kurganets 25 was spotted in production lines at the KMZ factory in Kurgan, indicating that serial production had either begun or was imminent. Analysts suggest that Russia has prioritized the Kurganets 25 as part of its broader military modernization program. While exact figures remain classified, it is believed that Russia has produced at least several dozen Kurganets 25 vehicles for testing, evaluation, and initial deployment, with plans to scale up production in the coming years. 
Some estimates indicate that Russia aims to field hundreds of these vehicles by the end of the decade, potentially replacing older BMP-2 and BMP-3 platforms in frontline units. The relatively low number of Kurganets 25 vehicles currently in service should not be mistaken for a lack of ambition. Russia's defense industry has faced challenges, including Western sanctions and supply chain disruptions, yet it has consistently demonstrated resilience. The Kurganets 25's production is a testament to Russia's ability to innovate under pressure, delivering a platform that surpasses the capabilities of the Bradley and other Western IFVs. The Kurganets 25 is more than just a vehicle. It is a symbol of Russia's determination to reclaim its status as a global military superpower. While the US continues to rely on legacy platforms like the Bradley, Russia is investing in innovative designs that prioritize crew safety, firepower, and adaptability. The Kurganets 25's development reflects Russia's broader strategy of building a military capable of deterring NATO aggression and projecting power across multiple domains. As production ramps up, the Kurganets 25 is poised to become a cornerstone of Russia's ground forces. Its superiority over the Bradley underscores Russia's technological advancements and its ability to outpace Western competitors in key areas of military innovation. While exact numbers remain uncertain, the Kurganets 25's presence on the battlefield will undoubtedly shift the balance of power in Russia's favor. In conclusion, the Kurganets 25 is a formidable addition to Russia's arsenal, offering unmatched capabilities compared to the aging M2 Bradley. With production underway and Russia's defense industry firing on all cylinders, the world can expect to see more of this advanced IFV in the years to come. As Russia continues to modernize its forces, the Kurganets 25 stands as a testament to its engineering prowess and unwavering resolve to defend its interests on the global stage.